Hey, and welcome back to our patch note. In most productions, today I'm here with you with another Trails in the Sky. Uh, Legend of Heroes, of course. Um, last time, I don't remember what we did. <laughs> it's only been a few weeks. Uh, Gull Seaway. Okay, so we were traveling, is what we were doing. Head into the next city. Because so we had this thing to actually fight. This thing's a static encounter. That, um,. Has to be done. So, uh, both of my HPs are just absolutely non existent right now. So, how far away? I've got to be a decent distance away, I think. I just don't believe that I am. Oh God, how do I get there? I just don't believe. I am right at the city. That's the orphanage. It's supposed to be this way. That's why everything's all aggravating. I'm not that far away because this right here should be the town. Okay. Isn't there an end here? They're not an end here. It's a windmill, ain't it? That is the end. Restaurant and the end. Ugh. Uh, talk to this person. I want to rest. 60 Mira. 90. Yeah. Went up. Just got my fingernails and I've got um things under them and it's hurting me. Or well, not hurting me, but they're 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 not perfect. I cut them a little too short. So as of this week here in my state, um it is officially fall or uh, autumn technically. Um even though, according to government and all that and calendars, they would say it is absolutely not. But um, if you go and look at it, not only are the temperatures we're facing fall and autumn temperatures, they're also um, you no, know, the leaves are falling. All every, everything's changing, like it would be in fall. What is also happening is um, some of th th there's a type of ducks that only show up here in that time. I'll go ahead and do this. That only show up during that time, and they showed up. So that makes it officially uh, fall because of that. Or autumn, sorry. Okay, so. Um. I really want to take out those flames fast. I know that. Good. That seems to be working out fine. I am supposed to keep her alive, I do believe. Uh, it's recovery. I want aqua bead. I'm gonna hit you with aqua bead. Happy those things don't move a lot. Not happy about that though. That's why I wanted to kill it. I turned it down on my side just a little. Oh. Fancy. Oh, oh, you bastard. And you petrified me? Shit. Oh, that sucks. That healed him, but didn't get rid of confusion. Oh, this is terrible. Really bad. First, kill that thing now. Got to protect the still, because if it's still it's attacked, she's dead. Don't you have the ability to like cure elements? Why are you not doing that? Well, it's good to see you're at least only attacking her right now. Let's do 
go ahead and hit you. See if I can just kill you. Apparently not. Uh, circle? I don't need a tear. I need a petrification heal. Blood tear. Oh. A mass heal. Does Petrify ever run out? And he dies. I'm about to lose him. Well, it's a good thing she's healing me. It's only 200, though. That's actually 350, not bad. Our bolt to kill him. Damn it. No. Didn't take him out. Getting beat up. Uh, I do get another attack. Get stone hammer, cause why not? I'll at least be able to do that. And that was her. I knew it. One hit. It's fine. That's a little less fine at that point. Well, he killed it, so it doesn't really help too much. Oh, good. That was actually a nice hit to see. Kind of wish I'd last at least long enough for her to heal me again. So, I don't want to fight anything else, honestly, right now. Um, Royal Academy Village. Go to Royal Academy. Let's see what's here. Maybe I could, no, rest. No. I don't think I will go that way. Let's go to Village. I know I was fighting everything to kind of level up some in it. I'm kind of happy I did. Because that did make that fight a little easier. At least bearable. So, so is, that, is that Ruin or Rune? How would you pronounce that? Feels like, I mean, it is in a port city. Ooh, there's a north and south city. Or it's our district. And it's a drawbridge. Just passed it in the middle of Main Street. Okay. Yeah, I kind of need to so I could um, collect some of my money. Hey, don't jump. <sighs> Went down there. I wonder if I can get down there. Does not look like it. That angle snap. Interesting. Huh? I could get down here? I can get to him. That's cool. Oh, I can also straight up just walk across it. It's like a uh, Venice, I guess. I don't know. 
Not really. Weird, weird little spot like right here though. A lot of weird little spots. There's Orbal Factory, which I don't think I've got any need for that. It's a hotel. Uh, please don't be 90. 90? Was that, has that always been 90? Am I crazy? Do I just keep thinking it's 60? This is a nice one. They actually got ceiling fans in this one. Fancy hotel. What is this? Oh, these are actual rooms. Nice. That's a fancy hotel. What do you have to say? Sky Bandits held me prisoner. Okay. I didn't want to get into a cutscene, but good enough, I guess. The Hundred Days War. I don't know, how was it? Okay, not cannons. No, not the bridge. Oh, well, that's a terrible design. Interesting. Sunk ships at the mouth of the river. Where I would get there. Racer Guild. Um, I wonder what we gotta do then. Okay, let's go, uh, see the city. Where was the drawbridge? Is this the drawbridge? Looks, oh, it said right on the other side. Oh, we're in the north block. Okay, so we need to go to the south block to find the drawbridge. That means this is the drawbridge. Makes sense. 
chapel. Food shop. Did not mean to run into the port. I will absolutely come and visit. Really see a lot of the ports. It's the last place we really didn't have much of a port. Oh well. Locked. Wonder why. Wonder if I gotta go across the drawbridge, which I kind of feel like I do. Designed. Kind of like it. Sure, wonder what I have to do to make the time go by. Alright, so. Uh, we got the bar. Loading docks. Oh. Cutscenes. Okay. That's uh, you know, a uh, nice indication that somebody's probably going to be hiding in one. Go down the steps. Nothing here. Come on. I'll find my way around eventually. Range is, uh, right. I think there's going to be something there. Of course. Pain, huh? Thank you. 
Yeah, I don't think it's gonna end well for them. the mayor. <laughs> Too well dressed to be part of this town. If only they knew. Tell them you, you leave. That's what you do. Uh, yeah. Who is this mayor guy? Mayor Delmore. <laughs> uh. So, within the last think, two weeks, I know since before I last recorded, new Guild Wars um, expansion came out. Uh, Wild Janther Wilds, I think is what it's called. And uh, it's actually quite interesting. I finally finished the story of it today. And, um,. It's got quite a few things that I really like. I love, I absolutely love the new Lowlands map. The second map's pretty nice too. It's nice, it's a lot flatter than what the last um, expansion had, all the maps, which I actually like a lot more. But um, I do like that um, the second map is nice. It is always raining, which doesn't really bother me. I actually like the raining areas. It, um, it's interesting. <laughs> It's right there on the, um, it's got a mix of like the, um, of dead coast kind of areas and like a coastal areas of, that's uh, seen a lot of death and destruction and all that. And then it's got a lot of, um, kind of ruined forest areas, not like where the forest is ruined, but where, um, there's ruins in the forest, like old buildings and all that, where there's been an old cult, which is interesting, um, just to kind of look at and think about how they go. There's a bunch of books across the, across that map, which... I've been finding, but I need to actually read them, kind of deal, kind of see what's going on. Um, but the first map, it's it's somewhat vertical. It's kind of down the edge of a mountain, so that's not not the best way to travel. But it's actually a really pretty map, really awesome map. It's so much larger than the last ones. <sighs> Why am I so tired? So 
suddenly. I've uh, been playing it. Um, I like the new Warclaw stuff that's come out with it. Really never had a use for Warclaw ever before until now, unless I was in World v. World, which even then I wasn't really using Warclaw, so... Um, like I, I did, I just used it for travel and that was all I ever used it for. I, kinda, I need to train it up again because they changed how the Warclaw stuff works. Um, and from World v. World and all that, so pretty much everyone had to restart on it. <sighs> and then my favorite thing is now they added something called a homestead. So before everybody had what was called a home instance, which was a map dedicated per character, not player, but character. You have multiple characters on your account and all that. And every character, depending on what race you chose, had a different home instance out in their home city. Um, and there was no like decoration or anything in the home instances. It was just, you could unlock these mining nodes that you could go in once a day and mine, you know, get some extra ore, wood, things like that. Just collection, um, well not collect stuff, but um, stuff that you could um, collect and then either store up for crafting or you could sell and trade them, little things like that, which was always useful. Homestead has all of that. Except everybody starts off with the same basic map. Um, one or two changes um, happens based off your race, such as like if you're a Azora, the race I play, all of my characters, um, you have some stools in some spots that aren't good, uh, that aren't there otherwise. But nothing else changes. <sighs> but it has all of the all of the mining instances. Oh, sorry, all the mining nodes still in it. Also has um, a new crafting table called the Handy Worker, or hand, yeah, Handy Worker, Handy Worker, something like that. And um, you can see all of your mounts and your boat, if you have a boat, which I, I do. See all of them in one place um, without having to sit there and summon them and all that. You can actually use your mounts in this one, the other old one you could not. Um, so they're all there, which is really neat. And you could decorate, you could build, decorate, things like that. So it gives you a house to start off with and you could decorate the house all you want and then it gives you a huge and I mean an absolutely huge area like it shows it has a fence around it but the fence is not actually the border of the area the fence is way past I mean the border of the area is actually way past the fence all the way over to the cliffs in the ocean it's quite a big area and you could just build whatever you want in that entire thing you do have to craft the building materials and all that <sighs> There and there is a limit. Um, you can only build like a thousand props, I think is what it is. It starts off with like 216 props already placed because of the wall in the house. All of those could be removed, so. But um, just little simple things, kind of neat little things to get into. Probably should have been paying more attention to what they were actually saying because I have no idea what they said. I feel like this right here is going to be the mayor's house. Hi there. Pretty place. Sapphire Gleam. <sighs> Cooks? Food? No. No food? No food. They don't want to feed me. Three doors just to get the helm. Oh, well. Is, is there anything I need to do? Um.
that where I was earlier? I think it is. You know what? I, I want to see something. So that's that. What if I happens if I go this way? Oh yeah, I can't. I did. I've already tried that. Okay. So let's go back. So I'm gonna go to that um that um other way. Not that way. This way. That's the Royal Academy. It's still wrong. Not where I want to be right now. Son of a bitch. Stop doing that. Where's your guild? So I can come back here. Okay. Able to now take jobs here. Royal family visiting, huh? I want this city to be a oh, hooligan free. I should probably read the second line. Can I get paid for the job I did? No? Okay. Yes, I can. <laughs> I 
And the bridge is going up. Sounds like somebody's hitting an old tin pot. They probably could have made a better bill. <laughs> Early in the morning, just before noon, and in the evening, and it isn't lowered again until the ships have passed. Am I even on the right side of the river for that right now? That's the landing port. Um. Yes, I am. Was not there. I missed it. It's, uh. Armed guards. Which is here. Ah, before we do that. Let's go see what they got. Uh, how about buy? That is stronger. And this is also stronger. Don't have enough money. What? What's with all of this other stuff? All right. So prevents confusion, prevents death blows. Yeah. Prevents faint, mute, seal, sleep, freeze, blind, poison. I'll probably hold on to. All right. So I need to get the boots. Three thousand mira each. That's gonna be six thousand mira. Wow. So let's do this first, I guess. Put a battle suit on her, which is okay. Whatever. So, shop, sell. No, I don't need that. Four of these. Still three of these. So one of those. Bye. Eight. Two of these right here. And then trade them back out. Shop sale. Okay. 
both of these could be sold. Alright, well that's good enough. Still didn't get payment for my um work. Ah, that's the wrong way. Right here. Okay. Got me go all the way back to the academy, though. That's way back in the path, and it's getting dark. There's so many monsters out there. Yeah. Alright. Well, until then, I hope you have enjoyed this. We'll see you in the next episode. It's uh, been my time. And um, I know it's just not really had a whole lot going on this episode, but um, we have. Let me go ahead and save for a free bit. Save it twice. Till then, I hope everybody has enjoyed this, and we'll see you in the next session. Bye.